Tommy. And I'm Abby, and today we'll be showing you tips and tricks on how to build your robot garage. Some of the features and benefits include solar illumination, a door that automatically opens and closes, high quality wood that is super easy to paint and customize to your liking, a two year warranty, protects your robot all year round, and houses 90% and fits 90% of robots. And you have access to your robot from the top. These are the bags that some of the parts and pieces will come in and on your instructions at the very top of the first page, the screws and some other parts are lettered by the letter that is in the bag. First thing you are going to do is assemble the weight for the garage door. So in our original video, we only had one weight on. However, you do want to go back and put on all three weights. Make sure when you are assembling the screws in the washers that the head of the screw is hitting the foam pad at the very top. This wood is incredibly high quality. It is also very customizable. You can paint it very easily. It also allows you to do more cool features such as this cool door. We are now assembling the roof and you want to make sure you look at the bottom of the roof for the L and R sticker and you put them in the appropriate size. On the roof hinges there will also be an L and an R. The left will go on the left roof, the right will go on the right. The flat piece will be assembled to the roof and the curve will go on the wood paneling. So the way the door opens and closes is through this mechanism. As the robot backs up, the mechanism lowers and the tension on the wire is released, which causes the counterweight to open the door. And as the robot pulls into its home, it pushes the mechanism up, increases the tension, closing the door. Some robots may not be long enough to hold the door shut on their own. So what we're doing is measuring and using a half inch drill bit to do a new notch. And then after this, you want to make sure you tighten the tension wire to ensure that the robot can shut the door. So this is the sign that we made. We made this sign using our 3D pen that is available on our website. Another alternative is us 3D printing it for you. Also, don't forget to install your roof cap to prevent any leakage into your robot house. We hope this video helped, and if it did, leave a thumbs up. And if you have any questions or comments, feel free to comment below or contact us by email or phone number. I'm Abby. And I'm Thomas. And thank you for watching the video.